For this next exercise, we're going to have Mary Eileen bring in her knees in. She's going to exhale and just curl in for a moment, get, pull everything together, connect her core, bring in her navel to her back, uh, down to the ground. And the distance to the wall is very important for this routine, too, so you may want to test it out. The way you can test it out is uh, Mary Eileen will raise her hands up. That's good. And she just have her legs extend and touch the wall. Now, she's in, a, she's in a good place. She doesn't have to stretch her legs out too far where she loses the grip. She always wants to keep her pubic bone slightly tucked in. So the distance is very important here. Her hands are extended, creating the ultimate challenge to have to grip no other place but down below the navel. This is also strengthening and toning her leg muscles, being that she has to grip on that to rely on the stability of her core. Then she'll exhale and bring her body back in. Let's go ahead and do that a few times. You're finding that you're in a good position on your mat with your feet on the wall. You're going back and forth. You exhale and then bring your legs out. And as you can see, her hands just extend uh, a little bit at a 15 degree angle. And she's going back and forth. And you see, too, just by the touching of the walls, enough to grip and tighten the leg muscles and tighten into the buttock and recruit into her core. If you were to try this without the wall, you'll see a big difference. You'll see that you can't really grip and you really can't tone those leg muscles. And so having your feet just barely touch the wall and or your hands in any of our routines on wall yoga, you are triggering and creating dramatic effect immediately. No guessing here. It's a constant repetition that is very obvious. And you're exhaling and curling in, and you'll see her eyes are going right past her navel, right to the wall. It's important that her eye contact is there because she wants to be able to recruit right into the center, make it very easy for her mind to comprehend and to remember, creating that muscle memory. All this is really great going deep into your joints and ligaments, being that the alignment is so perfect and you're able to grip so deep. A couple more times, when she brings those knees in, she exhales and pushes her navel to the back of the spine. Good. One more time. 